This video will show you how to post your blog post from Weebly into Facebook. You can also do it to Twitter. So the first thing you need to do is make your post. So click new post. Give your post a title. It might simply be the date. And then I usually create a separate title and some text. And I put an image over the text for my post. So I'm just going to put in here sample post. Title for blog Weebly. Then I'm going to just say this is my text for my post. And I would have whatever text I wanted in here. Then I would click on the image and upload a photo, or I could search for a photo as well if I didn't have one on my, my computer, but I wanted to find a photo from the internet. And again, you want to use their search because these are copyright free searches. I can adjust the size of my photo. I like it so that it's just embedded into the text. And um, I may just get some better text here so that it looks a little bit better for a better sample here. Of course, you can adjust your test text to, you know, ragged right or justify. Once your post is complete, you're going to click post up in the upper right. Once it's posted in live, you'll see a share. Now you do have to be logged into your Facebook. So if you haven't brought Facebook up, do that first uh, before uh, you click on share. And you can see that share on Twitter is already here and I can put my message on Twitter and click share and that would be Twitter. I'm gonna click on Facebook and again, I have to be logged in in the same browser to my Facebook. And then once this comes up, do I want to share it to my news feed? Do I want to share it to a page I manage? So I'm going to say page I manage. And I'm going to find my Girls and Glacier page because this is a Girls and Glacier blog. But I could save it to my page first and then share it to a group or a page. And then I could even say our latest info or latest trip or whatever and then click post to Facebook when I'm done. This looks just like this is really nicely formatted with the picture with the text um, as long as I have formatted it this way with the picture embedded in the text. So if I need to edit I have to click on this first and then I want to show you the difference between the picture being here and here where you get that blue box, you let go, and now it's embedded in the text and will look really nice in your Facebook post.